You want something good to eat this morning? A uh, lot of people have been talking about the unicorn frappuccino Starbucks is making, but how about a unicorn grilled cheese sandwich? McCartney from Wilderness joins me now. And unicorn grilled cheese, this yes. is really a thing. It is definitely a thing. Sh show me how this all works. I'm super interested. Absolutely. So last month, April, was National Grilled Cheese Month. Mm -hmm. And then, of course, we have this unicorn fad going on right now with mm -hmm. the rainbows. So we decided to um, put it both together. Um, actually, two billion sandwiches are consumed every single year by Americans. So it is a classic. Um, it's actually really easy to make. We just use the Sara Lee artisanal bread. Big, it thick is, bread to yeah, start. Good base. Thick, fluffy. It keeps all the cheeses in, which is really important because you do have to shred it. Mm -hmm. um, another survey conducted stated that Americans like to use the classic cheddar or American cheese. Mm -hmm. However, for this specific recipe, you're going to need to use uh, white cheeses gotcha. in order to make the food coloring. Gotcha. I was going to say, so you Absolutely. take food coloring. Take a look at this bread. We can get a, I think we've seen this a little bit here. This is the coolest thing here. So explain to me the type of cheeses you have on this piece of bread. So I have Fontina, Provolone, Havarti, Mozzarella. Um, you can use pretty much any soft white cheese. And then you're going to want to put them in individual bowls right. and color so them accordingly. Basically like, like this. Is it pretty yeah, hard? Absolutely. Does it take a long time to color them or is it just pretty quick? No, it's actually, it's super easy, a really fun project to do with the kids at home. It's it's yeah, I was going to say, my, my five-year-old would love something Absolutely. like this. Holy smokes. Yeah. So, and then, and then it's just basically grilled cheese from there, two pieces of bread, and then Absolutely. boom, we're uh, pretty much done uh, with that. I, I, is it, you, get, you guys make, you guys sell this at, at Wilma's? I personally, I do not, okay. but I think it's something that we might think about putting on the menu. Because I got to say, that, that would be wildly popular. You guys do all kinds of sandwiches and all kinds of stuff. You're all over the city. Absolutely, yes. All over Kansas cool. City. So how long do you, what's, what's your tip for cooking the perfect grilled sandwiches? Um, so we would stick with the three Bs. Um, mm -hmm. Butter, blend, um, and... The third B is. Can I cut this? Absolutely, absolutely. Right. Sorry, so you want to make sure yeah. um, if you're going to do the cheese and the bread, you might as well uh, go ahead and go all the way with the butter. That is so awesome! Check that out. Look at look at the the grilled cheese there. That is a rainbow grilled cheese sandwich. McCartney with Wilma is here to show us how it's done. I'm going to have some of this, Jeff. I'm going to toss it over to you as I have some of this. This is awesome.